Hi and welcome back to Calls Drones. Today we're going to have a look at the Cyma X5 UW. Hi, welcome back. So today we've got one of my favourite ever budget drones. This has been out a couple of years. This is Cyma X5 UW. And it, it, why it's my, one of my favourite is this thing is ridiculously easy to fly. So, in the box you get a user manual, which is excellent. You get a very, very nice controller. You get the drone. A spare battery, this one comes with two. The camera. Some prop guards. A charger. A micro SD card reader. And the all important screwdriver. The clip for the transmitter and the props. So let's just have a quick look what you get. So the, these clip into the end, so they just clip into the end there. I'm not going to fit them today, but let's take a look at what you get. So this is the drone itself, and this is absolutely gorgeous. It's a metallic red finish and it actually does from a distance look like metal it isn't it's plastic obviously it's got an on and off button there this is where your battery goes in the back here so this is your battery very very smartly finished off that's your battery there and that's your connector there so if you've got a normal JST the JST is built into the end here you could put a JST in there and just dummy your cable round but these batteries cost about six quid Battery goes in. It's obviously got geared brushed motors. And on the bottom here is where the camera goes. So here's your camera. Very neat. And there's your cable. The cable plugs into there. just plugs into there and then this spins on so I'm just gonna put you on hold for a second and by the magic of television we'll be back in two seconds with it built up okay this by magic it's now all built up so what I want to do is just straight quickly through the drone so I put the camera on the bottom the camera just as I showed you before just twists in it comes with a four gigabyte SD card you get it with it it comes in the packet how many drones do that at this level? Not many at all. So you get that. I put the phone holder on, there's a little cover. Look how neatly it fits. Look how smooth it fits. It's just perfect. So it comes with that little cover which you can clip and you clip the phone in. It runs on the Cyma Go app, which is one of my favorite apps for a budget drone. So as you can see, let's have a look at the screen. You can see there, got a bit of reflection because it's sunny outside but the latency is not too bad at all and that's about what it's like you don't seem to lose distance or anything so that's the drone with the camera with a phone it's got some buttons so on the back you've got photo and video button so a photo and video button and on here you've got 360 flip and if you press that one shot press it it also takes off and lands it runs on four AA batteries I don't, there's, there's hundreds of videos of this thing on YouTube I bought this because I've watched so many videos and I thought that thing looks to fly amazing so I got this cheap, they were currently around 48 to 50 quid it's worth the money because for a beginner drone it's fantastic it doesn't like a lot of wind so in a light breeze it's absolutely fine You've got, you're going to have no issues with it whatsoever. But if it's a very windy day, it's the same with all these quads. You need to be a bit careful where you're flying it and what type of wind you're flying it in. But it's fantastic. You have seven minutes flight time. It comes with two batteries. So you get two batteries with it. I can't say enough about this drone. It really is one of my favourites. And that's because it's so simple to fly. So 
I'm going to have another video after this one with, with flying, so I'll show it you flying, I'll show some footage of it through the app, it'll only be quite a short video and I'll tell you just why I think it's the best thing ever. But the biggest thing about it for me is, I fly mode 1, so I can fly mode 2 if it's got altitude hold, but I'm not 100% comfortable. If it's a GPS drone, I'm absolutely fine because I'm in GPS and it's all good. The great thing about Sima is, these all bind to the jumper, so every single Sima with an X at the beginning, so all the X range bind to the jumper, I haven't found one that doesn't. And this thing comes alive, set your rates on the jump up to 125% and this thing absolutely flies. It really is a fantastic drone. The quality of the finish on this thing is fantastic. It really is. I believe you can buy it in different colours. I think you can anyway, but I obviously wanted the red one because it looks outstanding. The red one just looks absolutely incredible. It really does look that good. So I've got no battery in the remote, but as you can see on here you can start and stop your video so you can take a photo. And you can start a video and record, but it will record to your phone. If you press the button on the controller, it will record to the SD card on board. So, I'm going to put some video footage on the end now of this video of it flying. I'll be flying it on a jumper. It doesn't fly any different because the rates on the jumper will be set to 100. So it'll be flying as if this is in its top speed mode. So you'll see it flying and I'll get some video footage up from you, for you. But all in all, this is definitely two thumbs up for me. This is definitely a highly recommended first drone. And there's not much more I can say about it. Thanks ever so much for watching. Have a fantastic day. Speak to you soon. Press start. Thanks very much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you do, please hit the like button. And please do consider subscribing if you haven't already. And hit the notification bell. Thanks for watching.